G'day, my name's Ian and today we're going to have a look at working out the surface area of a hip roof. That means what it is up on the slope, okay? So I've drawn a nice simple one, this is plan view looking down on it, 10 metres along, 4 metres. So we can find the ridge length by taking this from this, which gives me a ridge length of 6 metres. 6. Okay. So, what we need to do is find out what length that is on the slope. Um, that, so we can break it down into two rectangles. Um, so, we know that it's 6 along the bottom. But what we don't know, because we've got a slope of 22.5, which is the standard um, roof pitch for you know 99 times out of 100 roof. So uh, what we need to do is we find the run. So it's 2 metres on the flat from here to here is two meters. So I'll just go right here, run two. Okay, but we want what the length is on the slope or rafter length. So we go um, two divided by 22.5 and that gives us 2.1647. So on the slope, it is 2.1647 meters. So when we go to work it out, we go six meters, which is this length, and this will talk on the slope here. So this one here is 2. 1647. Uh, so we go 6 times 2.16. So that gives me 6.49 square meters in here for that rectangle there. We know if that's 6 meters and that's 10 meters, then these must be 2 meters and 2 meters. So the simple way to work it out is just to do it this. So two times one, uh, two times two point one six four seven. So we're basically working out those two halves. And two times one four six seven is four point three two nine meters for the whole lot there. So I look at it as though. The other half of that becomes that. So I've worked out then the whole area. And I also know that this is the same as this, which is the same as this. So that same calculation, 2 times 2.1647, uh, which gives me 4, then that is that one as well. That is... 4.39 metres for there. And that is the same as that, and this side is the same as that. So it's not as complex as it first seems. We just have to find the true length here, and we need to establish the ridge length, which is the difference between the long side and the short side. But it is certainly doable to be able to work out the surface area of a hip roof. They're just triangles. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it.